Hello to everyone at Dragons FC. Um, I've heard a lot about you, all good things. Uh, hope you're all doing okay in these weird times at the minute that we're going through. Um, everyone's fighting the battles and stuff and it's it's not nice, but hopefully we, we come, come out of it and come out the other side and yeah, back playing football soon. But um, in the meantime, anyway, Ryan has asked me to um, give you three my three best tips really to become a better midfield player. Um, and I've been thinking about it, and the, the things I can think of are all technical, really. Um, I think the first one's th first one's passing. I think if you're going to be a midfield player, passing's key. Long range, short range, um, accuracy, not giving the ball away, um, keeping possession is is vital for a midfield player, and keeping the the team ticking over. So um, yeah, if you're going to work on anything, work on passing. Um, I can't really say with both feet because I'm, I'm quite a one footer player but um, if you can use both feet then, then, that's, then that's amazing as well but it's a vital part of, of um, the game for midfield players passing. If you look at the, the top midfield players in the world, they're, they're great passes of a ball. So um, yeah, that's my number one tip. Um, my second tip is first touch. I think your first touch is is huge in football. It gives you it gives you more time. Like if, if, you, if your first touch is amazing, um, it gives you more time on the ball to work out what you want to do, to beat players, to to see passes. Um, so if you can work on that, like I don't know, bouncing the ball off a wall or whatever, just killing it, killing it, killing it, and just repeating, um, repeating that over and over again is is huge in football. If you have a good first touch, you can yeah, you can really control games, especially from midfield area. And then um, my third tip is, which I think is kind of a dying dying breed in midfield players these days, and I'd say shooting. I think if you're midfield player, you need to chip in with some goals. And the best midfield players over the years have scored goals. So um, we have the likes of Frank Lampard, Stephen Gerrard, Iniesta's. Um, just off the top of my head, uh, yeah. So shooting. If you work on your shooting from outside the box, inside the box um, is vital because if you're a midfield player that scores goals, you're you're a massive part of the team. And yeah, there's not many about these days. So I'd, I'd say I'd say definitely shooting. And there's no better feeling than scoring a goal, as I'm sure you know. Um, so yeah, shooting. So yeah, there's my three top tip with midfield player: passing, first touch, and finishing. So. Yeah, good luck with that. All the best in isolation and hope you're all doing okay in these in these tough times. And yeah, hello, hello Ryan. Hope you're doing alright as well, mate. Cheers, man.